I think that if you want to know what you should call people, you should just ask them. That's what I think. I've never really been interested in the term African American. Um, I th I think it's fine as a term for people that just want to be polite. That it's whatever. But the thing is, a lot of if not most Black Americans don't really have any close ties with Africa. So it's a it's just a weird thing to be called. Like I don't know anything about Africa. I've never been there. None of my family that I know of has been there or was born there. Like I have no no close ties to Africa. So I don't really identify as an African American. But if that's what you want to say to be nice, to be polite and, and to be sure that you're not saying something offensive, go for it. What's the best word for it? You mean for black people? Just say black. It's fine. You want to know what you should call me? Just say black. That's fine. And I will say that most people seem to be fine with that. As for like African immigrants, I don't know. You have to ask them. I don't know. I'm not, a, I'm not an African immigrant. It's similar to like, I, for those who have been watching my videos for a while, I used to use the term Latinx a lot because I thought that that was just a polite thing to, to refer to Latin American people or Latin people, you know, without genderizing it or whatever. But after asking around, it seems like a, like most people either don't give a shit or don't like it. There's, there's a group of people that do prefer Latinx, but most, most people don't care. <laughs> so I stopped using it and I tried to find something that I think everyone is fine with. So I just say Latin American or Latin now, and it seems like everyone's fine with that. So uh, that's what I go with. So instead of like trying to force this term on people without really asking them if they if they even like it or care, just ask or or research it. You know, I know not everyone has like a big audience that they can just ask, but you know, you can look around, ask, gather data over time. Talking with Spanish speaking Latino folks, a lot of the dislike of Latinx is because it's not linguistically consistent. Latina is an alternative I see, though Latin Latin American works as well. Yeah, well, I've, I've, one of the criticisms of Latinx is that it doesn't make sense in Spanish. Like you can't pronounce it in Spanish. My thought of Latinx was that it was like African-American is basically like a polite word that people who aren't Spanish can say. But, you know, I guess if you're going to have a word to describe them, then they should be able to say it, too. You know, and also, you know, there are Latin American people who don't speak Spanish, which is another consideration for sure. Do you feel the term POC is a bit of an erasure of the various cultures it's supposed to represent? Not really, because in, in America, at least, I can't really speak for other countries, but in America, it is useful to have a word to refer or to have a term to refer to everyone who is not white, because white people are the dominant group and most privileged racial group in America. So it is useful linguistically, sociologically to describe the entirety of the population that is not white because there's a commonality there that is useful in certain contexts. So I think that is useful to have a word for that. <laughs>